Growing up in the town of Morwena, Manitoba, north of Winnipeg, Reimer quickly became acquainted with small-town life, as Morwena itself, a predominantly Mennonite community, is home to around only 150 people. Not surprisingly, the school he attended wasn't any bigger. James attended Morwena Christian School, which was K-12. With only around 100 students enrolled, the Panthers goaltender began his academic career modestly as a kindergartner in the basement. Unlike many of his NHL peers, who were skating as soon as they could walk, Reimer had a later start than most, and didn't officially begin his hockey career until age 12, but he does recall filling the net for his older brother Mark before then while playing on the family's backyard rink. The only way I could play is if I was in net, and he could just rip clappers at me, James recalls. After growing up in a Christian town and attending Christian school, Reimer considers himself to be an Evangelical Mennonite and regularly attends Morwena of Evangelical Mennonite Church when he's able. At one time, he even had his faith displayed on the back plate of his goalie mask while referencing to the story of Jesus walking on water, featured in the book of Matthew. It's an anchor that keeps me from getting too low and keeps me humble enough to keep from getting too high, he says in reference to his faith. James married wife April in June of 2010, but how they met almost seemed like fate. While James was playing for the Red Deer Rebels of the WHL, April decided one night to attend her first hockey game ever with a friend in Moose Jaw. And as you would expect, she met her future beau that same night, and from there, it went to happily ever after. Now you're probably wondering how a kid from a small town pretty much in the middle of nowhere could ever be found by the NHL or even the WHL. But as luck would have it, while playing in a tournament for a church league in the neighboring town of Steinbeck, Reimer happened to cross paths with then director of player personnel for the Red Deer Rebels, Carter Sears who instantly saw promise in the 13-year-old. I got scouted playing one game, Reimer said. We lost six to nothing, but they must have had 700 shots. The scouts had no idea who I was. They've never heard of me before. But one guy saw me play that game and drafted me, just based on one game, he says. But I think we can all agree on the fact that it's not every day that you find NHL-level talent in a church league. 